Howdy folks, Jay Boone down here at Emerald City Guitars and I have a pick of the day for you today. Today, I have a 1961 Hardtail Fender Strat, among my favorites. This is an absolutely beautiful, wonderful guitar in all aspects in terms of playability, tone, the weight, seven pounds, three ounces for a hardtail, very lightweight guitar. Comes to us in all original condition, except for a refret, and it's a great job. Really nice and smooth down the side here, and lots of fret life. Uh, looks like it was done some years ago, but just in excellent condition. Great playing guitar, just well done on that refret, whoever did that. So you can see the beautiful three-tone sunburst on this guy in 1961. Your three-ply mint green guard, which really sets off that sunburst. Really dig that. Three position switch here, still intact. All your knobs. This is a slab board, which is a big slab of Brazilian rosewood on there before they went to the veneer the next year in 1962, which is a highly desirable aspect of this guitar. Just a wonderful, wonderful example. And I, again, I love the hardtails. They sound so good with that string through the body design like a Telecaster, no tuning problems and yeah, just this guitar's got a lot of get up and go. This guitar came to us in the original brown hard shell case. You can see a little bit of scarring in here. Generally, you'll see that if when a guy's plugging his guitar in and out, he'll hit that and bounce into the input jack. I've done that plenty myself over the years, so player wear is evident on this guitar. Obviously, it has been played, but it's just that right amount, just how we like to see him. Great 61 profile neck on this guy, kind of a not a super slim, but a C-neck here, not, not a big fat neck like you'll see on the, the earlier models, but just a really, really great feel on that neck. So this guitar has a body date of 860 and a neck date of 461. Well-worn, but in nice condition on the back. You can see there's no big dings on the back of that neck. Just a super great old pre-CBS slab board Strat. Today I'm gonna have Aaron Hebert in the house and he's gonna play it through this really great old 1961 Fender Twin Amp. I was out at a show last week that the Black Crows were playing out and I went out and took a couple instruments for Rich Robinson to check out. And I ended up doing a trade and got, he had two of these. And according to his uh, amp tech, this was the better sounding of the two. And I believe that is true after hearing this thing. It's just a really great sound and blonde twin amp, these things. Sounds so good when they're cranked up. So Rich had his tech put in the Eminence Legend 1258 speakers in there, but we do have the original speakers for this amplifier. But the volume he plays, I'm sure he was thinking, I don't want to blow these original speakers. So both of his blonde twins had those Legend 1258s in them, and they sound great in this amp. Also got it in a really nice Rogue case with the Black Crow stenciled on it, and it comes with a letter saying that who it belonged to and just some great history from a, a really fine guitarist in a great rock and roll band. So uh, Aaron's gonna play this guitar through there, through also he's gonna, uh, in the chain, put a 1961 Brown Fender Reverb unit, which has sold, so that's no longer available. But both these items are, and I'm gonna cut Aaron loose on these and let you hear him. Thank you. 
So there you have it, folks. My pick of the day, a beautiful 1961 Brazilian slab board hardtail Stratocaster through a 1961 Fender Twin Amp, formerly owned by Rich Robinson of the Black Crows. Thank you so much for tuning in. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit like and subscribe, and we'll see you all next time.